so okay I've been listening to a lot of the first albums of a lot of artists I like because I haven't listened to them in a while so I was like listening to them and I'm just like oh my god it's so good and I was I noticed uh, I, you probably noticed this too it's a lot of artists not all artists but a lot of artists I don't know it seems like their first or maybe first two albums are always like better than some of their other stuff and again this doesn't apply to everyone you know there's you know, the Beatles Michael Jackson they just were like consistently always good um, and other artists now that are still still good but I just wonder why that happens like I don't know if you agree if you've noticed this too with certain artists like the more you listen to them it's like you're still a fan but it's like the first and first or maybe first two albums are always better than some of their current stuff so i was wondering like is it because those albums are like genuinely like maybe not genuinely like objectively better than their later stuff or um you know it's hard because art is subjective um or maybe it's just that we think they're better because we have like memories attached to it because maybe that's like the first time we discovered that artist or something so let me know what you think like do you think those those albums are usually better and if so why um i think it could be a combination of both like maybe they are better <laughs> but um also like our memories make them better and i think when you know artists maybe like their albums later are not as good i think a lot of it has to do with like the record label and again this doesn't apply to every record label there are some good ones but i think mostly like the major ones that like they want artists to replicate like they'll see something trending in the music and they want the artist to do that even though it's maybe not their style or they might have had a hit and they're like okay you need to like do this again and the artist is trying to grow so i feel like the record label definitely me messes things up <laughs> um because i feel like I think maybe one reason I think the first maybe one or two albums I think are the best not for every artist but a lot of the time um, is because I feel like especially the first album that's like the most genuine like the most re um, I don't know how you say it but it's just like that's more true to what the art to who the artist is because that's before all the meddling from the record label you know even though when a first album is released so you know the the record label had some they you know they had a producer probably in there so they probably messed with it a little bit <laughs> but i feel like not as much as later albums like i don't know i know i've been thinking about this too much it's probably way too long but <laughs> i just wanted to explain what what i was thinking about this and what you guys think especially if you're a musician let me know um, but yeah, I feel like there might be a lot of factors. Again, I'm not saying this applies to every artist because there are some artists who just keep, you know, being consistently amazing and some maybe even get better and some record labels are really great. So, um, and then maybe other artists, maybe their first few albums are not as good. So I'm, there's a variety, okay? If I'm just saying that there's a trend, I feel like, or just something that I've noticed where I, for so, some artists, I like, I'll like their first one or two albums better than their other stuff. So let me know what you think. Alright.